Yeah, you could give it a go, Sarah. Right, we are live. People can see us. Hello, everybody. We are going to this today play Dark Souls, the board game. So hopefully everyone can see everything okay. There we go. Reason it like that. Uh, so this is the first kind of level, I call it, in the first campaign. There we go, yes. So, uh, the first journey it's called, and we're taking on the gargoyle who's up there in the top next to you, Blake. Um, who are we playing today? I'm playing as the Herald, and I've got like a spear, um, which is spear stuff, and also a talisman. Now, the talisman isn't like uh, other weapons, because it actually can... So, I can help you all gain stamina, so you can do better attacks. Or I can go and use some stamina to then heal someone for six stamina, which is quite Wow, hard. nice. Uh, but I can only have one of those equipped at a time. Yep. Um, and then I've also got my kite shield and herald armour. Yep. Um, I have got a... So my kind of like my ultimate ability is called Perseverance, where I can, where every character can gain two stamina. Nice. Over to you, Blake. Um, I'm a warrior and got an axe, a barren shield, just to speak up a bit. It's alright, come on. You got a warrior, yeah. Yeah, I've got a barren axe, a barren shield, and also an armor. And then I've got... Uh, cool. So you can charge in for free and then hit everybody for free, uh, which is nice. Um, which yeah. is really handy. So you're hopefully going to be our DPS. And then I'm going to play the knight, um, so I may end up being the tank, but obviously things can change. If we start to get equipment and stuff, who knows where we might take I'm, our builds. I'm going for my build is kind of a more of a spell base. Yeah, support. Sometimes uh, the herald's so, more so support I'm, base. So I'm going more support, Yeah. Uh, hopefully get a fireball, that, that's, that's a nice spell. Uh, but I'm probably going to go mainly support and defense. Yeah, cool. Okay. So I think we're good to start then. We've got our spark set, so we have three sparks, I think, is uh, yep. the right number. Um, which means there's three times that we can, essentially three continues. We can reset the board three times. Okay. Uh, we have our treasure deck made up, and we're good to go. Uh, have we got our rooms kind of No, I need to do that next. All right. Oh, I need to turn off the... Oh, Tuffy, hey Tuffy, yes, we've not died yet, but I'm sure we will. I need to yeah. mute my screen, otherwise we're going to hear sounds. Oh yeah. Um, right, so, this first campaign, let me just look at it, first campaign mission, we should have two level ones and a level two room. So in this instance, this room's not going to be used. Um, we're just going to have, so I'm going to okay. shuffle, the, shuffle the level ones. Remember, this one's the kind of getting you started. So this is... Uh, Are you sure? It says two level ones and two level twos, right? Uh, not on the campaign, it doesn't. So on the campaign, you've got two level one encounters, one level two encounter, and then the gargoyle boss. Okay. Not all of them use all six rooms. Yeah. Because sometimes this can be a double room if it's a mega boss. Okay. Or actually a boss boss. The dancer is a double tile. Okay. So... Uh, we will go... So we will go... There, that's a level one room. That's a level one room, and then we'll do a level two room. You're forcing us to go to level well, you have to put the level one rooms closest to the bonfire. So, so well, one question. Yeah. Would we, so, of course, we're not going to want to go face a level two room straight away to start no. gear. Yeah. So, could we visit a level one room? Yeah. And then go back through here. Yes. And visit a yeah, yeah, they're, they're just doorways. We can go whichever direction we want to go in. I thought so. if we went back there, we'd have to use spark. No, 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 no. This is just a home base. Um, we can even go back here and change equipment without using... The, the, the spark is a reset. 
So as long as we don't reset, we don't use a spark. There's nothing wrong with coming back here and spending souls because we're not resetting the board. So this is only if you um, reset. Because, yeah, because either we die or we're choosing to get things like our Estus flasks back or our um, our heroics back. So if we were to deposit souls, we'd need to reset, right? No, we Rather can back. we can carry so actually um yes, if we want to deposit them, yes. We're carrying those souls around yeah. with us. If we die we drop the souls. Alright? Cool. Right, let me put the chat onto like an iPad or something so I can see if anything comes up. How are you, Tuffy? You good? Yeah, Tuffy's always here. Tuffy's a good egg. And she's about to create a awesome new um, campaign for us to do for uh, no <laughs> um, a World War a weird World War Two type um, RPG. It's going to be very fun. Very nice. Yeah, like Cthulhu type um, stuff. Okay. Cool. I think we're good to go. Yeah. So um, this is where, for the first time, we get to separate. The player and the aggro. Um, so I think the, probably. Does the aggro stick? I really. I need no, to the aggro. Stuff. The aggro will move to whoever is on the turn. So basically, these start apart. So you can have aggro, aggro, and turn. Which, when we enter a room, it's a good idea to split it. But immediately, as soon as the next person activates, they also become the aggro. Use the tank. So probably best yeah. that I take the aggro I first. Think Blake should take the first. And one. then it'll be clockwise. So then you'll be next. Yeah, because right. maybe you could start off with a quick kill. Okay, so where do we want to go? Should we try, try this room? Yeah, we try right here. Room. Okay, so this room, it has got a crossbow hollow on, uh, where's my crossbows? There's my crossbows. So on the sword, so there, so right in the corner there. And then a sword and a crossbow on the other one. So there's a sword guy and there's a crossbow guy. One there, and one there. It also has a tombstone. Oh yeah. So um, that means we if can. If I remember correctly, tombstones allow us to uh, view a boss's card. That's right. Yep. Yeah. So when we go and fight the boss, uh, we can look at the one of the cards in his deck, and there's a there's a tombstone right there. So you can't move through this square. All right. Yeah. Uh, that is a solid block that you can't maneuver through. Right. So where do we want to go? Uh, so I'm quite happy up. to go front and centre. I'm going to go there. You I'm can't go there because there's a monster there. I'm going to go the far corner. Yeah. Now, I think Blake should go with you, Dad, so you can mm. get to that crossbowman. Mm. Uh, because that crossbowman yeah. will shoot it. I think, I think it will shoot you. Or you could, um, yeah, it costs you some energy to do it, but you could go in and do your big hit on these guys. Because remember, your stamina renews each time. Now, they are going to go first. Because we've entered the room. All right. So, uh, I need the cards for these guys. How's that going to be? Right, so in order, uh, the hollow soldier is going to go first. So the hollow soldier is going to move one towards the active player, which is you. All right. And he's going to hit you for four damage. So what... what um, oh, I've got one. Uh, just so check, you, you might have... Like you yeah. get uh, one from your northern, ar northern armour. So this is physical protection, that's magical protection. That's right. You get one from your northern armour and one from shield. So, you're so get two, two black, black dice. dice, and he's hitting you for four. Okay, so you take two damage. Great, so take two red... Hang on, you need some, you need some reds and blacks over there. Let me get you some... Yeah. So I can only kill... I can only kill the blacks. Um... But hopefully I can get kind of like a healing spell that will allow me to heal reds as well. Yeah. Yeah, if you take a whole bunch of those, then you can use them. I'll give you some black ones as well. So you want to pop two reds on the red end of your bar. Now, if you remember, your health and your energy are the same thing. So you have to manage how much you hit versus how much you get hit. It's going to be my turn now. Oh, I can't actually get hold of these blocks for some reason. Right, there's some black ones. Thank you. Cool. So now it is uh, your turn, Blake, to uh, either move and hit something. Or just straight up here. Yeah. You Which could. Do? Oh, we need oh, sorry, we didn't do the cross. We didn't do the crossbowman. Oh yeah. Uh, the crossbowman 
I'm going to try and move away one. So he isn't going to move. He is going to move to there. And then he's going to shoot me for three damage. And it's magical damage, which at the moment is not great because I've only got one black on I magic. I've only got one black. So we'll do this guy first. He's going to shoot me for three magic. And I take two damage. When you first begin this game, you are very weak. So the sooner we can start leveling up, the better. And then the second guy is going to shoot me for three damage. And I take all of it. So I reckon on our... Because if we die, we drop all our souls and we can't get them yeah. back. So I think for the first... For the first round, we could just go fight two levels at once and be to level two. So over to you, Blake. What do you want to do? You can either um, hit this guy that you're standing next to, or you can move to. Um, for, you can, so you can do one move for free. Um, and then each each extra move costs one I stamina. Think take out the. I, I would I'll, say take out the crossbow and. Yeah, I'll, I'll move to that. Yeah, you're going to move to there. Okay. And then, I'll hit and then the so he's got no armor and one health. So one hit. Yeah. You kill off, you kill him. So that's good. He is dead. Good job. Right. So now the turn moves. So I take the turn token, and I also take the aggro token. That was, uh, that was maybe not a great idea. Yeah, I could. Yeah, this could be the end of it straight away. Um, Hollow Soul is going to go first. He's going to hit me for four damage, but I get um, one black and one blue. So I'm not too bad. I'm a bit better on the physical. Good job. And I block all four damage. There we go. Now the knight will the the crossbow one will shoot me, and I block one, so I take two more damage. Yeah, let's just see. No, really fine. Well, we're not fine, fine. Um, uh, I will hit him back uh, with my sword for zero, which is just one blue. So I need at least two to kill him. Yeah, you get one blue for. So I get two. So one damage because he's got one armor. One damage goes through and he dies. Okay. So now both the player token and the aggro token go to you. Yeah. See, that's why I think we'll be all right. Okay. So um, their turn. Their turn. Holloman's going to try and move away from you, so he would move to there. Um, okay, so actually no, he wouldn't because that's not technically away. He can't go further away, so he stays where he is. And he will shoot you for three magical damage. Uh, so I'm going to get one black, and I get nothing, so, so I'll take three hits. Three damage. Okay, um, my turn? Yes. So, um, I'm going to move for three towards him. Yep. And then I'll use okay. one stamina to... Move there? Yep. Move okay. And then I can use my spear. I have Try to be one node yep. away to use my spear. Yeah, because James has got a spear. He can't be on the same node so as the monster. He has to be one node away. I think I will then use free stamina to get the plus one attack. Yeah. So it's going to be one black plus one, um, which should kill him. So that's three. Yeah, so three damage and he's dead. And there we go. We've cleared our first room. So that gets us six souls. Ooh, so. So yeah, now we've cleared the room, we get to reset our boards. So how how do you count the souls? Um, also best if we don't put them in there. That's what I'll remember, don't worry. Okay. How do you count the souls? Is it like? Um, um so it's two per player, so we get six souls. All right. Mm -hmm. I'm just thinking, if you play solo, you're only gonna get two souls. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's not great. <laughs> uh, let me just check. I'm pretty sure it is two. It might be six per tile. Um, Clark, can you point that down? Yeah. Uh, the party may purchase additional sparks, blah, 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 each time, blah, blah, blah. Uh, I think it is, I'm pretty sure it's two souls per player per tile. Remember, we used to get eight. Um, we used to eight when we had four people playing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. Right, so I guess we're going to come back this way. 
yeah. I'm going to go and check out this room. Yeah. So I think this. So I don't, don't mind being the aggro. Going... Okay? I don't mind being the aggro. So he has to go next. So I'll take the aggro token. So, right. like, where do you want to start? Um, well, the, yeah. sorry, we get to we get to look at the room first. So uh, we've got on the double swords. We've got two crossbowmen. Two crossbowmen on, on the double swords. On the single sword. sword, you've got one one like swordsman. Okay. And got two. Oh yeah, we get can we use the tombstone. Yeah, that's what tombstone can say. I've got more tombstones. And then each, on each person there is a, a barrel. So okay, so we've got barrels. got two barrels. Okay. Barrel and barrel. So the only person that could do anything, the the uh, rogue could, um, the assassin could roll through barrels as a dodge. So they are hard spots unless you use a stamina to smash them. All right. Um, but that's okay. Right. So now you can go in. So I'm quite happy to go. Well, I don't really move... matter. I guess. I think if they're going to move away from the aggro, so if we put you there. Yeah. They should move back into there, but they can't move there, can they? Yeah, so, so they would have to stay there, right? No, they can go there. Right? Okay. They'll just move. They'll just move one away, so they're going to end up there, whatever happens. Um, so I'll go there. Oh. Where do you want to go, Blake? Um, I'll go on the last corner. Yep. No, I'll go on the other corner. Yeah, you go on the other corner. Okay, cool. All right, there we go. So, uh, there go first. So the soldier is going to move one towards uh, Blake. Um, yep. So he'll have to come down that way, I guess. Yeah. I mean, we could go that and, way. Um, yeah, we can go that way if it makes up. We get to choose, so yeah. Um, but then he'll he can't attack you, so you're good. Um, the crossbowmen are going to move one back each, and they're both going to shoot me. So the first one's going to do three damage. Oh, I could do my no to it. I say two, so I take one damage. Yeah, you could definitely do your no to it. Um, and the other one's going to shoot me. And I'm going to take all three damage, so I took four damage on that turn. Which is not good, but it's okay. okay. Now it's your turn, Blake. So, so you um, can use a stamina to move, yeah. and you can use one to move in if you want. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to add um, two more. Two more stamina? To that. Well, is your node here only two stamina? Yeah. Wow. That's good, isn't it? You get two blacks and, two two blacks and hits the whole node. So as long as you get one. Yeah. Oh yeah, big time. So big cleaving hit. Takes out the two crossbowmen. No worries. So the turn token goes to me. Thank you. The hollow soldier will move one towards me. And not hit anybody. That's great. My turn. So I will move in for free. Just if you're all out, get on him. Uh, yeah, I can use four stamina. I won't, I won't even put it in. And and wreck him. So there you go, that's it, dead. That's another six souls. So these first rooms are easy peasy. So we know now that they're good, the good rooms to just farm souls. So that's what we need to do. Yeah. Now, I don't think we should risk it and go into the level two room. No. You think go back and rest? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, although we could go in there because we've all got everything, we've got our estuses. Okay, but we should just not be afraid of using it. Though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, don't take any risks. We've got our estus, we've got our heroics, we've got everything we need. So I'm quite happy to, to let's go in. So turn it over. What is it? So we've got a on the single sword, there is a silver bowman and a silver swordsman. Oh, that is quite heavy, and then a brute guy, brute, brute zombie. What the big guy that showed me in the picture? Big, big axe. Uh, oh, that's quite a tough. But to be fair, that is quite a tough room. So on the double swords, him and one, one silver swordsman. One silver swordsman. And there's also which... a barrel token on this bit here. Okay, and then a big lumbering zombie on the Does back. Does that actually do any damage? Yes. Yeah, he pushes you. He pushes you around. Every time he pushes you, he hits you. He basically okay. shoves you. Okay, so um, I'm happy to stay the aggro. So, so as you know, for the turn, you have to be the, you have to be the turn, and I'll keep the aggro. All right. So I ain't escaping him if he moves. No, well, I'm quite happy to. Can we I, have a barrel token? To barrel token, yeah. Um, that bow in? shoots the node, so don't bunch up together. Okay, how about we all split up then? Yeah, do you want to put that on the that, barrel? That, that sounds that looks, yeah. that looks decent. Right, so I need to get some cards out, some monsters. So can we even start on this purple bit there? No. Okay, so I'm going to go with Blake. 
Um, Actually, they both. Yeah, don't do that. I thought I don't have a choice. It's either you or Blake. So then go. Um, what if we all run one? If, you, if that bowman's going to shoot the whole node, so you definitely don't want to be all three of us. I don't think we have much of a choice then. Okay. Um, well, who does who does the best worst hit, the bowman or the swordsman? Um, so let me just get these in order. So you've got um, seven, six, three. So the bowman is going to hit for five, and he hits the entire node and pushes. Sorry, uh, the swordsman. He pushes. Hits the note for five. All right. Um, the great sword, the great bow. Sorry, that's the swordsman. The bowman. He hits the whole node for four, and he targets the aggro, um, and then he moves away. Okay. So I would, I would say. So I think. Oh, that's with this one. Who goes first? The knight is going to go first. Okay. So if we put all three of us in one square, he will move in. Push you off. We will have to take the hit, but then he will shoot you. Yeah. Okay. We can do that. That kind of works. We're all two of us. In, we're okay. all going to get hit, whatever happens. So this guy is going to move forward two. So he's going to move in. So we can push you off, and if you want, you can go. Where do you want to go, Dad? Do you want to go here or here? Yeah. Or there. Wait. Can we go? It would just be good. What's yeah, and where are you two going to go? You've so been pushed, so you've you, got to go somewhere. Could you, uh, no, because there's three. No, he pushes you anyway. So pushing regardless of how many people are on the node, yeah, you're yeah, both going to get pushed. Push, get pushed there. And just slap him in the I'll push it to there. Yeah, he's now going to move again towards the active player. So he's going to move towards you. Alright, and push you. So where are you going to go? Oh, he's going to move to here, right? Yeah. <laughs> he's then gonna attack you, which he has range. Wait, oh. Um, actually, let me just you read this card read, right. You yeah. read right. Well, look, it says he moves twice, so you have to do the two moves. So he moves twice mm -hmm. towards the thing, and then do an attack of. So, okay, so I think he'd still be here. I think you'd yeah. both be there. Yeah. Okay. Um, and then he'll attack you both for five damage, and when he hits, and then you, he pushes you both after you attack. So both you both got to defend five. So right. Blake, Blake, you two. I'll go first. So three. So you'll take two damage, and you're gonna take four damage, and then he pushes you both. So where do you want to go? Um, uh, I'll so go to the bowman square. So yes, yeah, so if you, I will go to there. Yeah, and you're gonna go yeah. to the bowman. All right, so, cool. I think I'll be able to sorry, stab the bowman. Okay. My turn. So your turn, James. Okay. Oh, the bowman's got to go. So oh, sorry. Yeah. Through. And the, so the hollow soldier. So that yeah, the large hollow soldier. He's going to move once towards the active player. So he's going to move to there, and that's it. That's his turn over. The great bowman is going to shoot the aggro. He's going to shoot me for four physical damage. And I'm going to take one damage, and then he's going to move away from me once. So um, we could move him onto here. Yeah. So how much how much armor has the large hollow soldier got? Zero. Uh, one physical armor. Zero so magical armor. Chilling. All right. Unless he's got more. He's wounds. got five health. Ooh, actually, I can move. On <laughs> the other guys have all got one health, but he has got five. Um, how about the bowman? I might move on to that square but and I can do a load hit. Maybe, yeah. The bowman has got two physical shielding and zero magical. Okay. The swordman and these silver guys have got two armour, basically. This is a hard room. Of, of all the level two cards we could have drawn, this is quite a hard one. Okay, so... Not really, buddy, but... What game is that? So my turn. My turn. I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use three. Okay. To do a plus one hit on the on the uh, great bowman. All right. Yeah. So I think since I'm gonna need a two, and I get a one. So. So I get so it's two, um, which we'll just get. Try, 
it will get farther than normal, but it won't do a wound. Or no, if it's if it needs to, you need a three. Okay, so I think I'll use my luck. You can use your luck to reach. So we uh, yeah, oh, okay. Wait, hold on. Is that alright? We're rolling your luck only allows you to roll one dice. What would you re-roll? Oh, so I had a there plus. is no three on that dice. So I knew I needed two, but I've got a plus one since I used my stamina. Right, okay. Um, but I got one. Okay, so you got worse. But yeah, so oh, I got the same. Basically, it's one dice plus one, and I failed. Okay. So it's not um, working, Clark. I don't know why. Now everything is like it in my arm. Oh, yeah, you're gonna get hit a lot. However, I think we can change it. Right, so, did that, so we were unsuccessful, yeah? Yeah, so can I have the aggro so I can shoot it to Blake? Okay, so the aggro is going to move to Blake. Okay, so it's going to this guy is going to come. So the sword's going to move once. You can avoid some stuff, yeah. He's then going to hit you for five. Um, I'm not too bad, guys, so you know. So good roll on this would be nice. Okay, so you take two damage, that's not too bad. Hey, can you use an extra And he's going to push you, so you could push onto here and do your big node attack. Or if you get pushed to here and then you don't get whacked by a hollow soldier. Hmm. You just or need to play, okay, buddy? Yeah. Go on. If he moves to here, you won't get whacked. And then I can also just, then I can just use the stamina to move to there. So All right, what, yeah, whatever you want to do. Um, yeah. We need to kill these two things. Yeah. Okay, so then um, Bowman. Do you know, is it the, is it this guy next? Or the bone? Um, the hollow soldier is going to move forward. So he's going to move to there. Or I could just drive there and do an med. Yeah. And miss you. And, and then, then the bowman's going to shoot whoever's got the aggro. Is that the break? Yeah. So two, two, how much damage did Shoot you for four damage. Is that magical? No, uh, you're, no you're, you're physical you've damage. Well. So you're, you're fine. You've blocked all the damage. Cool. Now it is your turn. Should I use my Estus? I would do your biggest hit and then use your Estus. Yeah, you could use your to... could use your heroic. What's your heroic do uh, again? He so he can so he can oh what you could do move for free mm -hmm. then use two stamina hit node. Um, you can't do another action up. This isn't like multiple actions. Okay. He can do one one so thing. So his heroic it would just be for zero stamina he can move and then hit the node okay which you can do anyway by doing yeah so i think yeah i might, I might I move, the... move to there and then spend two stamina all right yeah two stamina so he's so, so you need at least three yeah so, so you've got four which is the highest you can get it's a good job so does that do i'm um, this guy dies i think this guy's on this guy takes three wounds so Black, Black Diamond. Oh, it's got their charge card. Sorry. I'm talking about the blue thing that... That hasn't got, hasn't got any games on it. So we'll use that one, okay? The Black Diamond, um, full damage to the entire node. Which I know oh, right, okay, so that kills that guy. Brilliant. And yeah, and he's got one, he's got one wound level. left on that guy. Okay, I'm nice. going to drink my Estus now, because... Okay, flip over the token and I'll take these. Yeah, so you're gonna Estus up. And he's got all that lovely damage on him, which is fantastic. And then the player token's gonna come to me, right? Yeah, uh, along with the aggro. Along with the aggro. Thank you very much. You should get hit as much. Yeah. Although actually no, we need to do Right, the soldier, something. the hollow soldier's gonna move one towards me, so he's actually gonna hit me. Can you can you move that? Of course you can, yeah. I thought, I thought it's a straight line. As long as it's a straight line, uh, so he's going to hit me for five damage and push me. Um, so I'm going to get a black and a blue, and I block all five with a top roll. Um, can you push me one towards the um, bowman, please? So I'm going to go there, uh, and then this guy's going to shoot me for four physical damage. Wait, am I on the leg? Uh, and I block three of it and take one damage. <laughs> okay, can you move me one in for free? And then I will spend it at a stamina to move on to that node. And then stab. And then I will use four. Uh, yeah, I think go for the big hit. Use four stamina. And do a big 
complete hits on him. Yep, and two two turns of shield, two go through, and the bowman is dead. Brilliant. Okay, now we've just got that brute to kill. Okay. Uh, now it's your turn. Now, do I ask this? I think I think I'm fairly Probably. safe in that yeah, corner. I, I think I'm safe in that corner. Yeah. So uh, he's gonna move. He's moving to there. Uh, my actual turn. Dead. Um, uh, you could stab him. Yeah, that's what I plan on doing that actually. I've only got one ring. So, one, two, three, do that. So I get one black uh, plus one. And so I get two. I don't know if you'll be any good. So I think plus, so it's plus one, so it'll go up to three. Yeah, no damage. That's it, that's yeah. one. Oh, cool. So I got two plus one because I use my bigger attack. Yeah. Um so that was So you only, you only needed to do one damage then. So did yeah. you do one damage? Yeah. Brilliant. Um, He's dead. So that's it, we've cleared another room. So that's another six souls uh in our little cache. Wait, did we um yeah, six souls. We got six souls. Yeah, six souls. So we've now got um 18. 18 souls so that's pretty good so let's head back and rest yep so we're going to head back we'll use a spark da -da 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 -da. we're not going to go for a stab at the boss so we're going to go down to two sparks so the board resets and we can use our our, um, our trades okay so um each flip of a card costs two souls but if we don't want it at all, we can sell it for one soul. All right, the 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 blacksmith here will buy unwanted gear from us for one soul. So I assume we're going to want to kick off with some flipping. So yeah. the first thing we flip is the Calamthry uh, ring. It requires eighteen across the board. Um, I don't have eighteen across the board. How many have you got? Eighteen. Okay. Yeah. Um, characters in your node gain three stamina at the start of their activation instead of two. So this is probably more geared towards um, the herald. 18, what, what do we need 18? 18, 18 and everything. Okay, um, that would be tier one, tier two, tier two and tier one. Yeah, so not it's, a bit, it's a bit, it's a bit, I think it's a good item um, because gaining three stamina at the start of your turn instead of two and it's uh, everyone on the node would gain it that's pretty pretty powerful I think so, so I think it's I think we store it wait, but gaining it. Like yeah it's healing it, healing it. Oh. so basically and it's not so if it was my so let's say I had the ring when it becomes my turn if you two are standing on the node with me not only do I get three stamina you both get three stamina as well mm -hmm. all right so that's that's pretty good when you think about it yeah okay so the next flip this takes us down to 14 souls. Yeah, I've got it all measured out here. All right, cool. This is the Thrall Axe. It's 16 strength, 16 um, dexterity. It is a one-handed axe for zero, two black dice. For three, I'm not sure it's for you, Blake, or for me. I'm not sure it's great for anyone. Can you carry on? What's the, what's the two? Uh, the zero th so zero, zero is two black dice. Three is one black, one blue. So it's the exact I same as my long sword. Like yeah, I don't, keep it's nowhere near as good as your your, 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 your axe. Zero, your, the zeros are the same. Yeah. Except for two, you get to attack the entire node. It's shield. Like all it's, up, two it's two sixteen. Two. It's sixteen on each. So what do you need to be Actually, sixteen? One. You just need tier one on dexterity. It's up to you, mate. Um, I don't know. It's, it's the same as my long sword, except. One, it's got upgrade, so it has got upgrade um, sockets on it, which is it's nice. Cool. We don't have any upgrades to give it. No, well, we can. Let's put it in here. Let's not get rid of it. We'll put it in there, and if we get nothing better, you could always try and equip it. Yeah, um, draw. Yeah, so and this is going to take us down to what twelve? How yeah. many souls do you need to? Uh, uh, okay, um, this is a blessed, a blessed gem. The weapons attack gain one black dice. It's twenty-five okay. faith. Um, we need an upgrade slot first. Well, that axe is have an upgrade slot, um, but twenty-five faith for 25 me is a is huge, two. yeah, huge tier stretch. Two. Tier two. Tier two. Tier two. Yeah, so that's quite a stretch. Okay, um, place the ten. Ah, the old classic soul arrow. Oh yeah. Um, it requires sixteen intelligence. Oh yeah, 
Yeah. Yeah. So I'm not sure if we were playing the rogue, then we could put him. But we can bring the rogue in later in the campaign, and that might be good for the rogue. Because the rogue on the rogue um, or the assassin, that's tier one. Okay. This is eight. We're down to shadow armor. Um, this is for the rogue, but anyone can wear it. Thirty-four dexterity. Oh, no, Seventy. No? Ten. That's ten. Um, I don't think anyone wants shadow armor. I think we should sell that immediately. Okay, so um, uh, no, let's not worry about it. Let's not worry about it because we might bring the rogue in later. So I might want to play the assassin. Okay, the next one is pretty cool, um, but it's hard. It, this is for you, basically, Blake. This is a two handed sword. It's 35 strength, 25 dexterity. So, tier three on both. Yeah. Ooh. That's a lot. I can't it? even choose thirty-five strength. Yeah, um, but it's it's for two, one black, one, uh, one black, two blues. For five, one black, two yellows, which is legendary. Mm. So this is an end game kind of weapon. So we should definitely keep that for yeah, the future. Mm -hmm. Right, another one. Yep. So how many souls have we got left? We are now down to eight. Eight souls. Sunless armor. Thirteen strength. 13 faith. Um, I would like to pitch for this because it I makes me actually no. I well, want I want T1 strength and I've already got 13 faith. I, I could do it. Okay, cool. You'll need to be two. This is someone this is a bit it's actually the same, it's not too much different apart from the upgrade slot. So this gives one blue dice in physical defence and one black dice. Only got one black. I would only need tier one. To get that. So I, only need I two think ones Ooh, that. you need two tier ones. Don't you? No, yeah. I've got sixteen. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, I I could do it. Or James. Um, I don't mind. You're probably staying out of combat a little bit less, hopefully. I don't know. I think it's a toss up, really. Um, you're probably going to get hit. Reality is, I think you're probably going to get hit more. Yeah, it's true. Um, but. I think. So do you I both? Like you, can have it. Do you both just need one upgrade? Yeah, I just yeah. need one. Upgrade. Okay, so that's going to cost. You can give it to Blake. It's going to cost four souls. Four souls. Yep. So we are now down to four. And you're going to wear the sunless armor. Mm -hmm. Now, is the armor you're giving up any any better than what Blake's that what James is wearing? Uh, it's the same. It's the same. Okay. Except I can't wear it. Oh, okay, so we'll put that back in our cache. We can't, Wait, we can't sell it, but we can. But then, uh, could I put an upgrade on this? Yes. Imagine. If we find upgrades, then yes. And up, upgrades for armor are things like rings and trinkets and stuff like that. Upgrades for weapons are gems. Upgrades for armor are, are rings and stuff. Right, so how many souls have we left? Four. Four. So let's flip another one. Takes down to two. The Eastern Iron Shield. Uh, it gives one blue in physical and one dodge. Twenty-eight dexterity, so uh, twenty-eight tier two dexterity for me. Tier three dexterity. Oh, so you wait, no dexterity twenty-eight. Yes. Yeah, yeah I'm not sure it's any good. Mm. Okay. I think that's four. Right, and last one. Again. Last one, yeah. Last one. Yeah. All right, souls. Firelink armor. Oh, this is good. So uh, this is one blue for physical, one blue for magical, and two upgrade slots. Twenty strength. And fifteen intelligence is tier one for me on two things. Um, so I don't worry about. It. I'm not never gonna get that. Never mind. But we we. What's your what's your um what's your strength? Blake has got like, new armor. Yeah, he did. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. So I'd like to, if we can get round, spend the armor to get that. Well, I think we sell but, some items. I think sell the I assassin stuff. stuff. Yeah. We, I don't you think sell the assassin stuff. Yeah. yeah. So I think the ring's worth keeping. As we okay. level up. The ring's good. Um, did anything you get give you dexterity? No, you didn't get any dexterity. So you're the only person who's upgraded stats, right? So the, the axe is probably still worth keeping. That well, shield, I think, is worth I selling. Think, I don't think the axe is worth keeping because it's... You don't think so? No, I would sell it. All right, so that's two items we're going to sell. The two-handed sword is worth keeping. Shadow armor, so that's three. Four. Okay, buddy. So we're gonna get four souls back if we okay. sell this stuff to the oh, blacksmith. Right. 
So we've sold that to the blacksmith. Okay. Is our souls basically currency in this game? Yeah, yeah. basically, yeah. yeah. So we've got four souls back, yeah? Yeah, I've got them down. So let's do another flip. We got Poison Mist, so then, which is a spell. How, how far is it tier 1 for you to get like, better armor? Uh, on two, I need to go tier one strength and tier one um, right. okay, yeah. intelligence. So I would definitely say upgrade you to so, get that if we had enough. Yeah, armor. yeah. But next round we should get Next round armor. it's going to be eight souls, so it's not too bad, but eight souls and I can wear the new armor. Um, should we go round again? Yeah, we're, gonna, we're definitely going to go round again. Uh, so the first thing we got was a spell, Poison Mist. It is uh, 11 dexterity. Yep. And 16 intelligence. Mm, tier 1. Tier 1. Alright, so it's not bad then. And it actually, um, for 1, will poison someone. For 3, poisons an entire node. That might be useful. Mm. You said you wanted to become a bit more of a rangy character. So yeah. um, if it's only one thing to upgrade, then that's not so bad. Right, last flip is the scimitar. It is a one handed weapon, 20 dexterity. 18 intelligence, it is absolutely Jeez. a roguey weapon. Sell it. So yeah. we'll sell it, which will leave us with one soul yeah. in the cash. Wait, do you. Um, there we go. If you play by yourself, um, you don't you get less souls, but the, the, it's like less to get more weapons? Um, yes, yeah, so there'd be less cards in there because we wouldn't be putting the cards that we don't need. Right, so let's crack on then. We know where we want to go. We want to recycle yeah. around the rooms. These rooms Where's the are... card for that ice over you've got over there? Yeah, these rooms are pretty much identical. Right, so let's go farming some souls. So everyone should reset their boards. If you used Estus or anything, yeah, you reset yeah, it. Yeah, I made sure I've like, done that. Right, okay, cool. So the first room is going to be the crossbowman on the sword. The crossbowman and the highlight the guy out there. Uh, so who was the first? Who, who ended that? I ended that. So yeah, so you're game. first. I'll take the aggro. Are you, one thing should, One thing with that is that you're going to be taking two rounds of fire. So if I take the aggro, yeah. I'll only be, it will be... Alright, but they're magical, they're magical shots. Can you handle... No, my, well, not really. Well, I suppose we're both the same. We're both black yeah. dice. I think I've... What's he, I think what, I'll has play Blake play. got better magical resistance? Now he's got better nice. armor on. No. It's no. still just one black. Yeah, well, no, I'll take it. Okay. Because then we split around. Alright, cool. So um, I'm going to move into here. Now, these guys don't shoot the notes, so there's no real issue why we wouldn't all be as close as possible. Because we all want to get on top of them and kill them. I could move to that crossroad. So the order is going to be um, Hollow Crossbowman and Hollow Soldier. So the soldier is going to go first. The soldier is going to move one towards the um, whoever, the active player, uh, and then the crossbow hollow is going to shoot the aggro, which is you, James. Yep. So. So you're going to get shot for three magic damage from this guy. So I'm going to take, so take two. two damage. And then three magic damage from this guy. Okay. And three, just take one. one. Over to you, Blake. So I'm going to move one, hit one. You're going to move into there. Okay, two black dice. Um, oh, just enough. Uh, no, it's his armour and does no damage, does not kill him. He has one defence. Uh, you could re-roll the blank, use the no, luck. Okay. Um, so turn comes to me. Turn an aggro, please. <laughs> this guy's going to move in. Um, oh, this guy would have actually moved away from you. He would have moved. He would have moved to there. Um, he's going to hit me for four physical damage. So I block three, so take one damage. And then he's going to shoot me for three. Take two. And he's going to shoot me for three, take two more. That's a lot of damage to take in one go. Okay, my turn. I will just I take said, out this guy. That, that I think. is why I said um, let's just all split the aggro. Yeah, definitely. Um, I will hit him with just my blue dice. 
Plus one to the armor and one to kill him. Okay, over to you, James. And so we have to get shot a bunch? Yes, so um, not going to move, not going to move, but going to both so shoot you for three damage dodge. each. Yeah, um, there's a 50 50 chance on a dodge. I think it will go And it uses a stamina. So I think I might do one dodge. So I'm going to dodge the, try and dodge the first one. No. Okay, so to here. Uh, I'll actually dodge. If you dodge to here, oh, that's infinite range. Uh, you want to dodge? You want to dodge at him? Or... Yeah, I want to dodge. So that one shot right. So yeah, try and dodge. Dodge that way. way. Okay. Uh, but then the second one, I'll just block. Two, so I'll take one damage. One damage. Okay. Okay, so, so now... you can move for three. You can move to there or move yeah. to there. So I'll move to the red, red. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And then stab him with your with your spear. Yeah. Um. See, I've got to get a two on one black, which is unlikely. Or I could a three, um, which basically. Means I think we're going to be alright. I think you can use if you if you can use a bit of stamina. I think we're okay here because we know that guy only attacks the aggro. Yeah. So I'm gonna. So this is the plus one attack. So you say that's so two one damage. Plus one. So one goes through the armor and one kills him. Okay. Cool. And then it's going to go over to Blake. Yeah. Uh, that uh, guy this guy is going to, to move, away. move away from you, so to there, and shoot you for three magic damage. Um, so yeah, you've just done one. So you take two damage. Don't worry about it. I'm confident you'll kill him this time. Okay. Well, okay, you're going to move in for three, and then smack him with your axe. Yeah, three damage, one in his armour, two body damage, he's dead. Good job. And that's it, we clear the room, so six souls come yeah. to us. Ooh, I think the dice are a bit easier to keep out. <laughs> um, okay, let's go to the next room then, so clear your boards. All right. Yeah. Okay, so that room, James, is again the same. Yeah, so in this room, we're starting off with... Two of those. The zombie guy out there and that guy out there. Um, okay. Uh, so, it has to be my turn. So again, splitting the aggro would be nice. Yeah, so... Because um, whoever is the If I go there, they're going to move to there and I can move you to three. So, yeah, good, um, good point. So then if I go there, I can scare them away. Yeah. So they're going to move the away from me. Um, Blake can be there ready for when that guy moves close. Yeah, that's true. Okay, so their turn. So the, that hollow soldier is going to move there. These guys are going to move one away and shoot me, shoot me for. Um... They're going to shoot me. I'm aggro. Oh, okay, yeah, they're going to shoot the aggro. Yeah. So, um, might, I'm going to move my dodge one because that worked well last time. Yeah, so I dodge him. Yeah. So I move to there. Okay. And then the other one, I'm just going to block because I don't really want to move. So you get two, one, just one black one. Right? Two, two. So you just take one damage. Nice. Excellent, you've done that. Mm. Um, I will move in for free. Now, I don't have anything that can hit the node, sadly. So I'm just going for free. I think taking one, just taking um, down one is good. Well, well, I might as well go for four. You sure? Because they're definitely going to, I think they will probably get another hit off from you. Well, not if they're both dead. Not if one of them is dead, anyway. But that's a black and a blue. Okay. Yep. Definitely dead. Right, you're, uh, let me, you, uh, no, I should move second. Um, so I'm now with ba aggro and, um, well, what? Really. Look, what game are you playing? Pokemon. Pokemon. Oh, I can only play Pokemon. Pokemon. Pokemon done. Pokemon Think all right, Dad? Yeah, I'm good, yeah. Keep going. I'll be back in a sec. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, um, so now it's going to be their turn. This crossbowman, he's going to move him away. He can't move from here. Everything he's decided to move there or there. Um, uh, I say I'll move closest to me. Okay, it's going to be my turn. Oh. I can kill him anyway. Uh, that guy's going to move there because he's going to move towards me. Um, and then I'm going to get shot. 
So I'm going to get shot by that crossbowman, and I'm going to attempt to dodge it. Actually, you can't that. Those yeah. guys are in a great place for my no-code. Mm. Mm. Yeah, and I dodged it there. So, nice. guys, I dodged it and it there. Cool. Okay. Sure. Uh, now it's going to be actually my turn. And I'm going to free, use free stamina. And. Yeah, so I'm going to do a plus one hit on the crossbowman. Because magic damage is really annoying. Two, nice. Two. So that can be go up to three, and he's dead. So you killed this guy, yeah? Which one? The crossbowman? The crossbowman, no. Nice. Alright. And then these will go over to Blake. Their turn. He's, he's, he's going to come one towards you and hit you for four physical damage. So you're going to get one blue and one black. Nice. There's just one blue. Oh, one, one, one black. Shield. Yeah. Nice. Uh, and that's it. You completely block it. Um, now your turn. Here's two dice. Smack that, <laughs> smack that guy. Oh, just about, but it kills him. Does two damage. That is another five. Six souls. Say six souls. Yeah. So we're up to um, nice. 13. Right, let's prep the next room and get in there then. So you've got so to have. One thing I was thinking. Yep. What if we attack it from a different angle? Or come in through this door? Yeah. Yeah, we can do that. Although the brute would probably hit This guy would be right on top of us. So if we started there and done the same kind of... Actually, no, I reckon we come in from the same side. Yeah. If we had a... If we all go back to there, because you're going to take that. Yep. Yeah. I'm first um, in the door. Who's taking I the aggro? you should take the aggro, yeah, right, because you've got lots of physical defence. Yeah, these guys are all physical. So it's the, it's the knight, the, the hollow, and then the bowman. So, yes. so, so we're going to start off. No, I'm with that, buddy. This guy's going to move in. Yep. And uh, push you off the uh, No, he pushes. Let's push Blake off since he's the aggro. Because he, he will push. Cause hey, he has to push someone because three people are on the yeah, node, yes. Yeah, that's why I'm pushing him. Yeah, and now he's going to attack that tire node. So now he's going to hit me and you. For guys. five damage. So I'm yeah. going to get a black and a blue. I could try dodge it again. How, is it two dodge uh, or one? It is a, yeah, it's a two dodge. Okay, so I can't dodge can't it. can't dodge it. Uh, I get a two, so I'll take three damage. I'll take three damage as well, because I only rolled, but I, I rolled did, badly. I okay. Right, so the large hollow soldier is going to move once towards the active player, so that's me, so he's going to come there. Uh, and then the great bowman is going to shoot the aggro, wow. which is Blake, Blake um, for four damage. It's physical damage though, so you're alright. Oh yeah. nice, blocked it completely. Oh, He'll then move away one, so he's going to move to here. Um, we can move him to here if we think it's better. Um, yeah. Yeah, move to here. Oh, I can. Okay. If I Be move careful, onto okay. that node, I can push you if, like, if that so, so is that where you want to go then? Is that where you want to go? Uh, yeah, I think yeah, maybe there. Okay, right. So now it's going to be your turn. Then. My turn. I should try and kill that guy, shouldn't I? Um, he's got two armor. Um, I think maybe kill the. Well, we're all good. We're going to reset anyway, so it's not a big deal. Okay. So I'm going to use four stamina. I'm um, thinking because the bowman. He's, uh, I'm going to get attacked by everything. Cause yeah. If you can kill one, that would be really good. Let's kill the bow. I can always re. I can use my luck. I've got other things I can use, so I can use this. He's dead. Okay, so you may want Estus because you're going to get shot by that bowman. Yeah. Okay, so I will Estus clear my board, and that's that. Okay. okay. Um. Can I? Have uh, go, go, go to you with the aggro. Alright, I'm going to go and talk like that. Can you guys this. play through the next turns? So, I'll um, be back in a second. him to there. Uh, this guy, he can't hit. So now I'll go to the bowman. Bowman will can't move back, so he just tries to shoot me. Um, 
Which I get two blacks to hit your dad. Um, yeah, uh, I get one. Where is dad's defense? Do you want to roll it? Okay. Do you need to check? Yeah, this is the one. Okay, so. So our dad's not going to take any damage. So I'm going to take three damage. Uh, so now my turn. I will move to there and then I will use my more powerful shot to try and hit the bowman. Now if I get a two I kill him. Nice. So it will be two plus one because I use my more powerful attack. So that will go up to a three and three, so three will break his armour and do one damage to him. Do. So, um, then I'll Estus. Okay, so that is now the end of my turn. So these are going to go over to you. It's going to be the enemy turn. So he's going to move to here. Yeah, now I need to check what he does. Let me get my dash ready. Because what weapons give you defence? Uh, depends on what weapons they are. I don't think they can. Because it's got a defence thing on it. Oh, it's just like... Hmm. It's because it's a... You can dual wield them. You can yeah. dual wield weapons. So, uh, the large hollow soldier, he's going to hit you for five and push you. Oof, okay. I'm going to try and get my highest roll. Okay, I'm going to take one damage. That's, that's fine. And then you're going to get pushed. So, um, Wait, did I get pushed behind him? Uh, yeah, but it doesn't really make a difference. So let's just push you to here. Um, that's going to be your turn. I'm going to move. You can move on to him and um, hit him. I need him to back. Okay. Sorry, three. So that will hit him for two wounds, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I will have to get to check that. Uh, yeah, so there's one physical, and you got three right. So you can take two wounds. I'm moving this to dad. Alright, so he's going to take two wounds. And now the token's going to go over to Dad, just as you arrive. <laughs> so if you want to know what happened, yep. I hit the Silver Bowman for three damage. Right. And that killed him. Nice. So And then this guy, also by the way, Blake rolled for your defence because the Silver Bowman shot me yep. you. Yep. He, got, he got five, four, so it didn't take, you didn't right. take any damage. Cool. Then this guy came and hit Blake. Blake has took one damage, Blake went and hit him, he took two damage, and now it's going to be turn. So is he gonna So he's gonna move and towards move. so I'll go yeah. wherever behind him. Uh, or yeah, you're there. Yeah. And then, uh, so so he's gonna hit me damage. five damage, okay? And I take three. Gee, we should go kill him and then Yeah. So I'll move him for three. So I reckon go all out on him. If you have like an ultimate super slow ah. damage. Super Not smart. really. I can get a black and a blue for four. Which I feel fairly safe about doing. That leaves me three damage. So I get four damage on him. So he's got what's just three damage. That kills him. Yeah. Blah, blah, blah. He's dead. And we get six more souls. So currently we are on um, 19 souls. 19 souls. Nice. Okay. Um, so we go back again, yeah, and we reset the spark. The nineteen souls. Now I think it's worth checking, make sure that we're not just flipping stuff, that we can actually upgrade stuff. Because yeah. we do need to go after the boss at some point. So the thing that I wanted to get was yeah. the firelink so armor. Eight souls for that. So that's I need I need tier one strength, and tier one. Let me just check it is. Base to tier one is four souls. Do you want to yeah. do that? Yeah, I think so. Okay, that takes us down to 
11 souls. And I can wear this. Now, has anyone got 12 strength? Yep. I've got so you might want to wear I think my armour. Okay. So, give me the blue. Yeah. Take away my roll or my dodge. I'd still take a blue. Okay. Yeah. All right. So you can wear that. Well, are you sure I can? Yes. Yeah. Absolutely. Can trade it's armor. Class. No. Right. Just it's just recommended for class. Doesn't mean you can't wear it. Okay. I think I'll put the symbol on the top. No. Right then. Um. The other thing was the poison mist, oh, I'm which just is put it over here so yeah, yeah. which is eleven dexterity and sixteen intelligence. Um. That's that's two two or intelligence. Mm. So. Oh, you're not very intelligent. No, I'm really thick. Actually, no, I'm, pre I'm pretty much standard in terms of to be honest. So, what's your big stat then? I guess faith, faith is it? Yeah. Okay, yeah. I so can go all the way up to 40 with that. Um, okay, alright, so I think we. I'm fine getting handy now, don't worry. Yeah. Well, you've got just, you just got an upgrade to a blue dice on defence, that's not exactly bad. Right, so shall we flip a, we'll flip a thing? Yes, this yep. takes us to nine, does it? Titanite Shard, so um, this is good for anyone with a weapon upgrade slot, which um, I don't think any of us have I, got. I, no, I have one, but keep it. because like, Oh, it's definitely one. good, yeah, it's oh, definitely a yeah, good thing. It actually makes that axe now more appealing. Ooh. How, um, what do I need for that axe? Oh, we sold it. Oh, yeah. Okay. Absolutely. So, I, know, I, really, <laughs> I didn't think it was worth it. <laughs> okay. Actually, yeah. All right, so, um, down to seven. Oh, it's a big old meaty shield. So it's 21 strength, which I have. Um, I can go up to tier one. Uh, okay. It's like Dad already has it. Oh. Yeah, and then it's 21 faith, which is tier two for me. Um, and then that's also it's tier, tier one for you on I'm faith, tier, but tier 21, two, and then strength, it's like tier two. So it is a good shield, but just not for now. Oh, um, keep it. Keep it. Yeah, I'll keep it. Yeah. Is it recommend what? It's for any one? class, but it's basically for me or you. Um, cause I think it could be good for me. Yeah, yeah. I agree. If you did take it, I mean, it makes you a hell of a tank. It's a blue. It's a blue dice on um, physical and a blue dice on magical. It's very so. you actually. Um, right. So we're now down to seven. Uh, yeah. A sorcerer's actually, no, staff. No, no, now, now we're down to five. Okay, a sorcerer's staff. I think we should just sell it instantly. I don't think anyone can use it. Can I take a quick look? Uh, 15 strength, 30 intellect. Neither of us, none of us are intelligent. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, it's, that's a great end game weapon if you yeah. manage to draft. Right. So one we get question. one back, so we go back to six, because we sold it. Oh yeah, so one question though. If when we when we start the next level in the campaign, will that all get reshuffled back in? No, no, we've sold it, so that's the deck. So, so okay. Yeah. <laughs> So oh, for the next campaign? Yeah, next campaign's fine, but well, not for this so campaign. When we finish, so when we finish this round and defeat him, yeah. when we go to fighting the big new demon, yeah. will that The stuff that's not been used, yes, it can be, yeah, we can shuffle it back in again. Yeah, because I'm thinking if we've, we're discarding these endgame weapons and we yeah. come in with like a few... Hard leather armour, um, which is 26 strength, 26 dexterity, 26 intelligence, mm. uh, it's, it's assassin armour. Um, we ain't never going to use that. Mm. Uh, so so back to five again. Back up to five. five, yeah. So this takes us down to three. Replenishment. It's a spell for someone with 25 faith, which is probably tier two. Tier two, tier for two. But zero, all characters within range gain one stamina. For oh, two, for two, no, yeah, but. Yeah, what's, what's, the, what's the second one? Uh, all characters within range gain one health. So it's a proper healing spell. I've got, yeah, I've got. For zero, all characters gain one stamina for free. One character within range gains six stamina. Yeah. So why you do a I think it's good for. Attack, so yeah, it's good. It's a good spell for later on, I think. Mm -hmm. uh, right, last one. Okay. It's a bow. So we're down to one. Yeah, so we're going to sell that straight away and go back up to two. None of us are going to use a bow. Well, I mean, I could, but. A sharp gem. Um, weapon attacks gain one strength, but it's um, that's a one black gem, but it's a 25 dexterity. Mm. Um, we'll keep it in case anyone actually okay. gets the 25. Uh, should we sell three anything? for us two? I yeah, it's tier two, we? it's tier two for me. Should we sell anything from that pile? Um, I think so. 
A sharp gem, spell, shield, spell, gem, big two-hander, uh, another shard, um, and a ring. There's nothing there that I don't think is worth getting rid of. We're really sucking at the moment. We're not doing great at getting treasure that we can use. But that's okay, because remember, this is only a level one boss, so we might not need much to be able to take it out. All right? Um, so we've reset, so reset your boards. Yeah. Right. So do we want to get around once more? Well, this is the boss run now, so we're going to head towards the boss, yeah? Yeah. So take the... Actually, they're both. Can't we spark one more time? <coughs> Only if we think we're going to one shot, <laughs> one shot the boss. <coughs> I don't think we're going to do. Well, we one shot it before. Really? Just oh. in case. We all suck currently. No, we don't. We've all got good armor. I think we're right. But none of us have got new weapons. That's the thing I'm worrying about. <laughs> yeah, but this is level. One, this is level one boss. I don't think you're meant to go in there fully geared up, right? You're supposed to go in there and. And you know, in a, in sort of level one gear. Okay. We're a little bit tougher. We're a little bit. We're certainly a bit tougher. We're not going to do any more damage, but we're tougher than what we were. You're rolling blues. You're rolling blues. I'm rolling blues on on defense. Yeah, we're good in defense. It's just I can do a maximum three damage. Yeah. And I'm no different. I can only do. Um, oh, you can do it. You can do. Maximum I can do five. five. I can do a so, maximum of four. Exactly. So we're not exactly. Yeah. None of us are good then. Well, let's see. Let's see because if in here we have, let's say we have some bad rolls. If we get to here and we've used like our uh, estuses and stuff like that, we definitely don't. We want to go to the boss with all of our stuff. Yeah. All right. So let's do this first. Let's do this next room. So this is. Uh, Should we go from there? That's um, really matters. Because we're going to spawn right. Yeah, next. but we want to get we want to get um, more souls, right? So. Um, if we're going for the boss, it you're matter. the next it's turn. The boss, right? You're the next turn, so I'll take the aggro. Yeah. Uh, where do you want to go? Um, I just, I mean, we all went in the middle before, and it worked fine. Yeah. So let's just do that. Yeah, we just want to get in their faces as soon as possible, don't we? So yeah. there we go. Right. So <clears throat> the hollow soul is going to go first and move one towards um, you. Uh, three damage. Three damage. And then he's going to move away one. So he'll move to here. Uh, those damage are targeted at you, Dad. Oh, they are targeted at me, you're right. So magic, I now get um, a blue rather than a black, which is better than nothing. So take one damage from the first guy, and then take two damage from the second guy. <coughs> okay, it's now my turn. Um... I think I'll just kill the bowmen. They're the most pain. They're the most yeah, painful. Yeah. So I'm gonna move to there, and I'm gonna do a free stamina attack. Yep. Yeah. Because they're the bowmen. So as long as I don't roll a blank, it's guaranteed skill. Because it's plus one. You yeah. always say that as you roll blanks, but good on that one. Yeah. So he's dead. Okay. Right. Uh, turn goes to Blake, and you get the aggro as well. You're gonna take So this damage. guy's gonna come in and hit you and this guy's gonna stay where he is and shoot you so this guy's gonna hit you for four physical damage so you take one damage good job and then the bowman's gonna shoot you for three magical damage oh take all three but that's okay right you're gonna hit this what do you want to do um, I think the skeleton, right? Oh yeah, I think the skeleton. Yeah. Actually, if I don't, <coughs> he will it cost the stamina to get to. The you button. can you can move there for free, and you can place you can. Yeah. Pay one to get to him. Because he's magic, and we. Yeah, he's the worst of the of the two things. He's the worst mm, threat. So, so, and then just hit him with a normal, whatever yeah. your normal hit is. That two blacks, is it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So one damage on his armor, one damage kills him. Okay, right. Yeah, because we're all good on. <clears throat> then it turns to me, it's and cool. he'll just stay there and hit me. But I've got lots of. I'll uh, put this aside because yeah. it doesn't matter. I've got lots of armor, so he's going to hit me for. Um, actually, no, it's just a black and a blue. I thought it was two blues. Uh, so he's going to hit me for four physical mm -hmm. damage, and I'm going to block it all, so nothing happens. And then why not? 
I will wail in him for f with four stamina and kill him. So we get six more souls. Yeah, and clear your boards. And then we're not going back, are we? <coughs> oh no, doesn't really matter that much. What do you mean? Oh, I'm just saying. Well, the souls matter because we'll get them at the end of the boss fight. We get six souls for killing him as well. Yeah. Well, that's all you get. No. Um, but so this room. Uh, you sure? No. Yeah, we might as well, guys. The souls are so, we need the souls for the next the next encounter. So we, we never want to not farm souls if we can. So this was two bowmen here. Swordsman there. Swordsman there. I reckon uh, he's going first. I'm going first, aren't I? Yes. So I'll take think... I'll take the aggro. I don't mind being shot. I think, I think this guy yeah. you know, swapped no. me and you, swap me and you. Uh, well, we want them to move one away. Well, they're going to move oh, one I away from you. I thought you were first. I was the aggro. Okay. So, so the high soldier is going to head towards um, okay. you. So they're going, they're going to move back one, one and both shoot me. So yeah. I'm going to get a blue dice. So the first shot, I take one damage. The second shot, I take one damage. So that's nice. Into my shield. You'll go. Oh, triple stamina. Stabby stab. So I'll triple stamina one of those uh, crossbowmen. Um, wait, can I need to put the dice back there? So I think so, oh. it so it doesn't hit. Um, that's the end of my turn. Okay, so now they're now gonna... both things go to everything goes to Blake and Blake yeah. gets a little wiped out. So you're gonna get. This guy's going to come in. Yeah, that guy's going to come in. They're okay. going to step away from you. Then You're going to get the, the soldier who's going to hit you for four physical damage first. So that's better, don't you? Which you blocked, that's fine. Hmm. Now you're going to get shot twice by soldiers, so this is three damage. So you can take three straight away. Yeah. And then the other one's going to shoot you for three as well. Okay. And you're going to take two more, so that's not great. Yeah. Right, now it is your turn. So I would suggest killing the thing that's in front of you, really. Yeah, swack. But for zero, use whatever zero stamina is. Yeah. Thank you. If he wants to use stamina, it'll just do a swing, uh, like full loaded back. Yeah? yeah, cool. Three. So he's dead. Yeah. Right, per turn passes to me. So at least they're going to shoot me now, which is better than them shooting you. So they're going to move one away from me. Yeah. Yeah, and they're gonna shoot. Um, uh, is that the best place for them to move? Right. No, move them back to there. That's yep. it. Yeah, that's the better place. Um, so first one shoots, and I save all of it. Second one shoots, and I save two of it and take one damage. Right, my turn. Unless you want to move. It's a lot. Oh, it's it's a lot to get up there. Oh. Oh yeah. But we don't want to keep shooting. They are, they are the kit. They are the silent killers. Without taking them out, killing one's probably worth it. So yeah, move me up one, and then onto them. So that's two stamina to get there. And then I'll just use my normal blue hit for free. So I kill one. Having one of them is a lot easier than two because that's mm -hmm. six potential six damage on someone is a lot. I'm just okay. going to spread. Um, it's not your turn though. No, my turn. It's going to move so, one away from you. Move him there. It doesn't really matter. And then shoot okay. you for three magical damage. Okay, so I'm going to get one black. I just hope that guy there does not do magical damage attacks. One damage. So, yeah, one damage on me. Um, I'm then going to move one stamina to move again. Then three stamina to do a more powerful attack. Yep. Yeah. We're completely safe as long as it kills him. It's all right. Yep, that kills him. So um, that'd be one, one plus, plus one, one is it? One. Okay. Yeah. So it kills him. Yeah. Kills there you go. Him. Another six souls, and you can clear your boards. And we have no recipes to our stuff. We yeah. never would have used it anyway on those ones. Yeah, it's this room. We'd like to get through this room as clean as possible because mm. that determines how well we are when we go to the boss. Do you want to pass me the models? Yep, yeah, so uh, Bowman. Okay, Doohickey. I think we, we're going to be much better on. I feel like we're going to be much better on this one because it's no, no magical. Yeah. 
Um, and we've got a whole bunch that I've got. Who's going first? Blake's going so first. Blake's going first. So, and then could you take that? Do you one? want to take it so that I only get one round of attacks? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. So, so I think if we all go there, yeah, yeah, he he will move in, get move, push one of us out. I'll I'll get pushed out. Yeah. And then. I'll take the shot, you guys, but you guys will have to take the swordsman. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. So in order, the knight is going to move towards us all, yeah. pushing one of us off, and then attack the node for five damage. So, yeah, so right, you're going to have right, one, I'm gonna get a one black and a blue. So you're going to take three damage. I'll take damage. two. Well, I've got a bad roll. Okay, right. Um, then the bowman, so then the large one's going to move one towards us and do nothing. And the bowman is going to shoot. Yeah, I'm going to move him there so he's more of in the corner. Yeah, he's going to shoot for four damage. Yeah, so he's going to shoot me. Um, yeah, I get one black and one blue. And then he's going to move one away. So I get four, so yep. I'm right. Yeah, and he's going to move yeah. one away. Yeah. Yep. Okay, um, now it is actually your turn, Blake. Okay, so. So you um, could. Uh, I'll just get. I think kill him because he does the yeah, most damage. Yeah, kill, kill him if you can. He's last one that does. Yeah. Could you kill him with a move? Yes. Okay, because I'd recommend doing that. So three damage, the so two goes through and one kills him, so he's dead. He's only got two armor, he's only got one health, but he's got two armor, so that's, that's him dead. I think you should. Actually, if I move, I could move there. I think move here. Because what we need to do is we need to get him to just go around in circles. Yeah, we have to cut. You kite him while you kill other things. That's what so people see, do. I'm gonna go there. Why? It's then gonna move on to him. Yeah. Uh, no, because it's not gonna be his turn. He's gonna move towards you. So right. you can move him down to here. Uh, he would uh, go it's towards one, me. One it's, not, it's not technically sore towards it's me. One space. So. I would say he'd move to that red one. <laughs> he would come towards. That's definitely not. If you're facing someone, that's not towards me, is it? That's towards me. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I know you're saying in that it's only one square, but that's definitely towards me. That is mm, just miranding. He hasn't got any closer, has he? So he would move to there. All right. Okay, I'm just thinking in the game of the actual nodes. Right, uh, so the large one soldier is going to, so the turn comes to me, and the aggro please. Turn and aggro. I mean, I don't mind gaming things a little bit, but that's definitely not, uh, <laughs> that's definitely towards me. He's not meant to be realistic. <laughs> he, he's come towards me, um, and does nothing because he can't reach. Uh, <laughs> this guy is going to shoot me for four physical damage, so I get a black and a blue. I save it all, um, but then he'll move away, and he can't move away, so he's gonna stay there. Right, well um, my turn. Um, so I'm gonna get hit by the big zombie. So, but I reckon it's probably worth me doing as much damage as I can to the big zombie. So move me in for free to the big zombie, and I will. When, go... he, moves, when he if he hits you, super when attack. He moves, stab. Because I don't know if you hit. And move hit, or if you just do, I don't know if it pushes you off. Um, this says it's to the node, so I don't think he hits on the way out, it hits okay. on the way in. So I'm gonna do four, and I'm gonna try and see if I mean, I can roll five. If I roll five, I kill him. Oh no, I don't, I can't kill him. I do one damage to him, which is a bit disappointing. I can get a higher. You can't. Um, okay, can do four damage to yeah, okay. Your turn. Okay, so um, this guy's going to move in. Push you. He's going to push me. I'm going to get pushed to there. Yeah. And then I've got to block five physical damage. And I get, so I take two damage. Two damage. And then the bowman is going to shoot you for four Ooh. damage. Should I get take one? Which one should I be more aggressive to? I think you need to take on the zombie, I think, because I think Blake James can probably take out this guy now. Maybe. I don't know. He's um, got two armor, so you need to do three damage. Yeah, so then I'm going to do my bigger attack with my spear. So bigger, but it still sucks. Uh, and it is one black plus one. I missed. I could use luck. I don't think I need to. Should. 
If you don't use luck, um, can we survive? Blake, Blake will get hit by ball damage. And then actually, he'll get hit by nine damage. Block sets at me, so. Mm. I just got hit by nine damage, and I take three wounds. I have to. Does any of us have the native ability? Can any of us make three damage without using stamina? I can't. Well, I can, but I have to roll essentially a six. I can make th I can make three damage. Yeah, but you've got two black. So yeah. It's kind of difficult. All right. Yeah, well, let's so get. Well, so it's up to you. Do what do you want to do? Do you want to? Do you want to? Um, I could also do three damage. Do you want to reroll? Do you want to reroll it? And, I think I'll reroll. You're gonna reroll. Ah, oh, damn. Okay. So, um, your turn, Blake. The so, hollow is going to move towards you, yeah. push you. Did you actually get hit I'd, onto Yeah, I'd, I'd push onto the bowman. And now you've got a book for five though. Five damage coming in. <laughs> yes, Wait, you're absolutely you right. Dark Souls, can we survive? Probably not. Yeah. Yeah. Welcome, Warwag. Thanks, taking a lot of damage. Yeah, we're not, we're not doing too good. We're literally trying to get through this room without using any it, specials. It Okay. Right, so now the bowman is going to shoot you for four physical damage. And if you if you mold, I you guess won't, you, won't. you can't die. Yes, you can actually. Uh, two. I don't think I'm, there's, there's not a to, there's not a blank on the blue, so you'd have to roll one. So he, he was gonna, okay. I'm gonna have to. Drink if there was a blank on the blue, then he could have died. I'm gonna have to drink the yes, Esther. Do you die? Yes, I do. Are we, are yes, we really do. gonna get round to you guys? Are we? Actually, I'm gonna go. Uh, if you don't kill him, then yeah. If you don't, so try and kill this guy. If you don't kill him, I think you have to Estus. Mm. Yes. So. Which is a yes. shame, but it's what it's what we've got. Mm. Yeah, because. Oh, that was an awful roll. Um, you to... could try rather than Estus. You could try your luck. I'm gonna try my luck. And we get to re-roll one of those dice. Obviously, the blank. Yeah. Two damage. So you failed. You failed. Uh, we need, we to, need that to be two. I'm not gonna have to drink that. That's gonna be really. That's really bad. Yeah, we're not doing. We're not doing very well in this room at all. So you, you think you've got to drink your Estus because um, there's no guarantee we can kill these things in this turn. Okay, right, fine. Um, we may have to go back. Yeah, we may have to go back and reset. Um, I think on this reset, just my turn. So the one. hollow is going to move one towards me and you. Okay. And hit us both. If well, you move, I think you move, move, I'll move there. And I'll move on to the. Oh, actually, no, I won't move on to there because he shoots oh, the whole node. There. I'll move on to there because I don't want I don't want you to get okay. shot, Blake. Okay. Um. So you and I are going to get hit for five. Okay. I get four. I get three, so I take two damage. I'm also not in great shape. Mm. Not so. Um, <laughs> We definitely need to kill this guy. Oh, he's going to shoot me. I could actually die. Nope. We could actually die. Please, um, please. Four okay. damage. And I get a black and a blue. It's unlikely. I need to block three. You need to block two, right? If, if, four, I, four if I fail, I can use my heroic. It's okay. Uh, so I block three and take one. So I'm all right. <laughs> you are definitely going to need to Estus though. Yeah, um, so now I will move in for one. Maybe the boss won't be as bad as you think. Really, I need to use, I need to Estus then do it. Do because... it. Can you not do it first? Because I'm just thinking, like, no, maybe we can't finish the zombie, then you can go for Blake and kill but if I roll a, But if I roll a blue on him, average dice is two, so I'm not going to, I'm not going to get through his armour. Um, yeah, so okay. uh, I need oh, to do Estus. I need to do a bigger hit. So Think if I Estus it. first, I can clear my board. Unless I kill that zombie, it will yeah. it will hit you two. Uh, yeah. No matter what, I can. And then and then I can use four yeah, to try that, and kill one. that guy. Yeah. So this no, gives me a black and a blue. It's no guarantee, but I need three on these two dice, which I don't get. So I'm then going to use my luck to re-roll this blue. I still, oh my god, we have done so badly on this one. Um, yeah, so he's still alive and it's your turn. I think we may actually die on this tile. Um, can I have those? So, um, I'm gonna try and bust me out. <laughs> exactly, Warwag, yep. Yeah. I have four children, um, but 
but uh, yes, these two do like playing games. Okay. So even in lockdown, you can get your games played. Cool, so I've blocked everything from the archer. Not okay. Too healthy. Yeah. Um, so now your turn. You've got to kill this bowman, man. This bowman is killing us. But you've not got enough that You can't actually output yes, three damage, can you? I can if I get two on my back. Okay. Um, please stop saying yes. <laughs> Sorry, but you need to do it. <laughs> Do I really? Yes. Draw two health. Or I can do this, or I can do this. Alright, come on. Okay. What have we got? What have we got? I think I might just be best healing you guys. Can okay. you not heal yourself? Because me can... and Blake are actually okay. I would heal myself. I can't. I can heal me and you of free stamina. Alright. Blake had stamina. He could also okay, hit. so that's probably worth it then. So I'll swap out this. Yeah. And I can use the free thing on here. Well, it'll be my heroic. But I think we're, we're, we're in it now, mate. I think we have to use. Um, so we can both heal for so one stamina. So one stamina. And then I can use my heroic yeah. uh, perseverance, and we can each gain heal for two stamina. Okay. And then I might as well just move away because. Yep. So turn goes to Blake. This is going to be a bit of a bash. Yes, yeah, we've all, yeah, good. What are you, what are you painting, Warwag? Oh, no. That's going to get hit as well. Yeah, I'm going to hit um, as well. So. I say push, you're going to get, it's only going to be free on there, so you might yeah. as well get pushed off. Okay, yeah. And then, Beck, you're going to have to take the hit, though. I can, I can take You're in the better position, technically. But he's also going to get pushed. Give me um. Uh, yeah, you're still going to get pushed. But so, I'm you just... could get pushed to here. Yeah. 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 And then I can just... So he does five, as he pushes you, he does five damage to you. So nice, damage. you only take one damage, nice. Mm. Okay, then Bowman. So, four, four damage from the Bowman, Blake. Alright, uh, take two. Two damage. Oh, no, that's not, that's not, charge here. That's not too bad. Yeah, hit? good idea, yes. Uh, Berserk charge. Does that also give me a node hit? Yeah. Yes. Oh, yeah. So, so for literally nothing, you can flip this over, move in. And, then and hit the whole yeah. node for your biggest hit, which is um, two black glass, and get lucky. Oh my goodness, we are doing horribly. <laughs> and you've used your luck, so there's nothing you can do there. Why? Why? Man, we have struggled that, in this room. I could have rolled four then, and I would have killed We like really have struggled. Everyone. Right. He's going to... Oh, great. Okay, so Daddy's going to hit you. Yep. Um, I'll push you onto the bowman. Yeah. Turn up to you. So it's five, five. You need to block the five. I take three. I take uh, two. Uh, up here. All right, and then uh, he's gonna also shoot me for four. Yeah. Which is just a blue. Oh, it's blue and black, right? Uh, uh, no. Physical. Oh, is it physical? Okay. So sure. I save all of it. Okay. Right. I'm gonna use four because we need to kill this thing. So um, because right, I get two back. Could start my turn, and then I'm going to use. Remember to get two stamina back at the beginning of each of your turns, yeah? Oh, oh okay. Um, um, it wouldn't affect any of us, though, Blake, because you've got no stamina. Come on, I need to see three damage. Show me three damage. Yes! yes. Okay. He is dead, finally. Okay, now we've got that. Oh, cool. Elf Scrolls doing some Elf Scrolls painting. We've got Warwag in the chat, guys. Say hello to Warwag. Hello, Warwag. Uh, no, not Warwag, and just Warwag. 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 <laughs> not Warwag, no. Warwag. Um, Warwag. Okay. Warwag. Uh, what? Let's go, Warwag. Warwag. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't start that. that, that. Um, finally, we killed something. Now that goes to you, he's uh, going to push towards you. Frank. And if, he, and if you fail to block everything, he kills you. I can't, no, I can't physically die from this. Okay, good. Oh, oh I'll just take one, nice. Oh, just check, you, yeah, okay, you dropped your spear, you didn't drop your shield. Oh, yeah, I wouldn't have done that. Okay. Why is that? I'm going to switch back. Switch back. Um, I might as well. Where did he push you to? I'll, oh, push him, I'll push myself to the ground. Okay. So I'm gonna hit you with all my might, and then oh my yeah, that makes sense. The maximum you maximise your board. Or I could just not Esther move to there to be safe because uh, he's not. 
as long as you guys can try As long as he's not going to, yeah, if he's not going to move towards you, then there's no danger, is there? Yeah, so, so I'm not going to S this. Right, but this is two blacks, is it? Uh, yeah, so this is one black plus one. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. so that's three. So that three. does two damage to him, so he's now only got two life left. And now I can use my three he's moves. Quite he's got five health, man. Wow. Oh, and that's nothing compared to the boss. The boss has got like 26. Wow. Um, so I'm not going to S this. I'm going to stay there. Yeah. Turn right. goes over to Blake. All right. Um, so Blake, your turn. Pass him the tokens. He's going to move one towards you, but luckily doesn't hit you. Okay. Now your move. turn. You need to do three damage to him. So you want to move to him. So three and move. And then black dice. Oh, yeah, my bad. Can you do three damage? Yes, you can. I... He is dead. <laughs> Huzzah. <laughs> We get six souls, James. Yep. But my goodness, did we use a lot of stuff. Mm. I used my Estus, I used my Luck. So I think we've got to go back to the campfire, which means we're on a one shot. We've still got to get through this room, by the way. So pass me your character. Right, so how many souls have we got, James? We've got 18, 18 souls. 18 souls. Now I'm hoping we get a better weapons. We need something, because we struggle we struggled big time in that Do you room. want to take another look? Uh, there's, whether there's anything we upgrade. There's definitely, because we, we're looking at weapons here. I think we're all fine on that armour. We blocked most of the stuff. We haven't got, there's no weapons in here that are anywhere close. So the only one is a two-hander for Blake, but we are a country mile away from getting that. 35 oh. strength. Let's draw 35 strength. strength. That's, yeah, that's, that's TIF 3, right? Tier three Which again. is, uh, uh, like, <laughs> 28 souls. <laughs> How much is 35 strength for you, tier 3? Uh, tier 3, so that would be, so that was... Oh, um, tier 3 for it then. So, yeah. let's, so, move the flip, down to so, 4. So, okay. 16, yeah. So, we've got the Cathedral Knight's Armour, which is 18 Intelligence um, and 22 Faith. Uh, tier 2, tier 1. It is, it is meant for your gear. Um, it is meant for you. It's blue, a blue on... Um, defense and two blacks on magic. We but don't have we don't have the souls to do it. We just need to get better weapons. Yeah. Great. Going down to two. Fireball. Um, I'll just sell it straight away because it's an intelligence weapon, and neither of us are getting. Uh, well, actually, I could use, if we go from tier one to one. tier three, uh, tier two, I could use a fireball, um, but I don't think I'd ever use it. Um, for free, it's two blacks. How much is the intelligence on it? 23. 23, okay. Which for me is that, tier two. Yeah. I think there are assassins. But we'll just, we'll just, we'll just sell it straight away, yeah? Yeah. The Claymore. Uh, so it's a big sword. 30 strength. Uh, I could get that all tier two. two. Yeah. And 26 dexterity. 26 strength. Yeah, tier 3 is like yeah, yeah. tier 3. Um, I'm tier, yeah, tier 3. I think well, I should sell it. Cause I could, um, yeah, I mean, I could get there eventually uh, because that's tier 2 for strength on me and tier 2 for dexterity. It's a two handed weapon. We're all the same distance from it. Yeah. Do, you, I think Do we want to keep it? Because we, we will level up eventually. Is that? As long okay, as you I really, really sucking on the weapons. Uh, well, guys, as far as video, so Warbags asked the question, as far as video board games, like video games that have become board games, is this our favourite one? Now, I can't think of many others that we've played. Um, um, good point. If I look around the room, because we haven't played Elder Scrolls, have we got any other video games that have become board games? We've got board games that have video games. Yeah. Um, you got Mario Monopoly. As far as a uh, board game with, um, so what's t what tends to happen is when you have video games become movies, they're awful, aren't they? Yeah. There aren't many that we would say are very good. But Sonic for video is games, yeah, but Sonic is okay. But video games that have become board games, this isn't, we like this. So yeah, that's the only thing we can say. Is it worth playing if you find it somewhere? Yes, it is. Um, yeah. And we have lots of expansions uh, because I've got it all on the Kickstarter. Um, but no, it's certainly a good game. Uh, it can get a little bit, but this bit here is a little bit repetitive because we're just trying to, we're in the early start. It's definitely like a slow burn. 
you got to get your characters to a decent yeah, level like, like before things kick off. Exactly, yeah. In the game, it's not just run to the boss and kill it, unless you're very lucky and very good. Um, hey, they do. Okay, yeah, I've not seen that one. Right, um, so where are we going, Jane? We're flipping again, yeah? Yep. The Brigand Axe. 19 strength, 16 intelligence. Oh, I could do that with tier 1. Um, intelligence. Um, no, there's ones that no, says 16 it's, intelligence. It's, again, it's not very good. They're all dumb. Right? They're yeah, we're not. Help. So I'm going to sell that straight away. So. Right, an ember, which is always good, because anyone can have this. Um, uh, this basically uh, reduces your damage. No, it's not always best for me. It's not always best for the tank. It's for those who can't take, because basically it reduces your damage by one. So when you get hit for three or more. We've all got the exact same defense except you've got better magic. Yeah. Is it for magic? So in that case, if I am the one that's going to get hit the most, then I will take it. Oh, as you know, it could go to black. I don't care. Yeah, I don't mind. Um. But an ember's always good. I mean, this reduces you're damage tankier, by one. You're tankier. Yeah. Blake's, Blake has got um, Blake's gonna be in there, but he's not as tanky, so maybe he can have it. Uh, what do you roll on defense, Blake? I roll a blue and a black, and then a black for magic. Right. So slightly, I'm slightly yeah. better than you at magic. I don't mind. You can take it. Okay. So if you take three or more damage, it reduces damage by one. So it won't work if you only take um, two damage. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay, cool. Right, so flip again, shall we? Come on, we need some get stuff. Uh, the Golden Wing Crest Shield. It is 26 strength, 26 faith. Oh. It is clearly for you. Uh, it's even got your symbol on it. But Again, I'm nowhere near it. But unless we start levelling you up, I don't know how we ever get you near it. Because, like, are you just waiting for something to come up that is, like, at least a minimum upgrade? Yeah, I guess, but like, I okay. feel like we need better weapons. That's rogue, so we'll sell that straight away, so plus back to that one. You've got a cool map for your, um, like, blows up. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we've got another ember. Okay, cool, so now two embers. So okay, I'll, yeah. I'll, I'll take an ember then, being to, um, that's cool. Right, next flip. We've got a whip, so we're going to sell that, because that's for the rogue. <laughs> Uh, where are we now? How many souls have uh, we left? So we that plus two, and so we're at, we're at six left. Six souls that, left. Drawing that one takes us down to four. Okay, piercing shield. It's 16 strength, 16 dexterity. Um, actually, uh, no, I don't have enough dexterity. It's not that great. Again, tier one for both. Yeah. Why can't we draw like a sword that has like two blues or something? Yeah. <laughs> what we use? We're all uh, this is all, all we're doing is pick up armor and shields. Uh, the next one is an east-west shield. Oh. Um, it's twenty-eight intelligence. I'm not even that we much. are doing awful for one really? picking out gear. Yeah, sell that. Um, is that are we on the last one? Are we? Uh, no, we're on three. One. Okay. A winged spear. Twenty strength. 22 faith. Tier 2, tier 1 again. Yeah. Literally and we've got two. one soul. And we've got one soul. Why can we not get a I'll sword? Keep it. keep it. Yeah. Okay. There we go. That's all our souls spent okay. for pretty much nothing. We didn't upgrade. We have done. This is our worst play of this ever. We've now got a boss. Yeah. Uh, yeah, this is a good co-op game, yes. Um, uh, it is. Uh, this one's being frustrating, though, because we don't normally have stuck this hard for getting... Well, yeah, there's a big old pile of treasure there, and we haven't found anything that's of use so far. Um, I think we well, sell, minimum. I think we should sell one of the gems to draw on our card. Uh, well, we could sell... Um, what if we just sell the shield? Sell it? But the, hard, the likelihood of you picking up something that's going to fit your character now is none. Um... It's just I don't mind. We could we could sell the so. sell you the, the holy gem. The holy one, yeah. They're a replenishment one. All right, we'll sell we'll sell that to the merchant. Yeah. We've now got two souls. And then draw a card. So we'll draw a card. Oh, no. Now please be a sword of some sort. It is armor. Oh. Worker's armor. 
and it's 12 on every stat. Uh, I can't even do that. I can, but it's no good for me. Um, I reckon, I think it has a slot, but I think you are already two, have slots. Two slots, yeah. I don't have a slot, but yeah. I don't... Uh, and I think I would just sell it, so I would just sell that. Can you use that? Can you Let's use sell one more. Shop? We can do one more thing. We should keep. Oh, no, we should definitely get the size. No, we stuff. just sold that for one. Okay. Uh, and, and we can sell something out of here for one. With the tie shard, can you use it yet, Dad? No, it's only on weapons. So I need weapons with upgrade slots. Oh, okay. um, and we haven't got any weapons with upgrade slots. Should we get rid of the poison mist? We think we're going to use poison um, mist. Uh, sell it. Yeah. yeah. Sell it. Okay. So sell poison mist. Sell that. To, uh, this is our okay, last. Okay. Please be a uh, sword. <laughs> it's a shield. It's no, a it's armor. a sword. It's a, a Murakumu, which is a big old sword, uh, but it's twenty-seven dexterity. Uh, so we ain't getting any of that. So we'll keep it just in case. Are you right. Crying? I'm not, I'm laughing. <sighs> Let's go for the boss, guys. Yeah. Let's go for the Why? boss. I think we should go this way. Um, Why? Actually, I don't mind. Actually, yeah. no, we can go that way if you want. Go that way. Yeah. Uh, I think we can just soak it. Actually, go this way. Do you want to quickly clear the room anyway and get the souls? Yeah. We might as well. So this is our last, our last um, shot. If we, we, did, we didn't look at the tombstone. We no, we do that at the end. We do that when we encounter the boss. Okay. All right. So we're going to quickly clear these three rooms and then we're going to take a stab at the boss. Yeah? Let's do it. Yes. Yeah. Right, this room was uh, crossbowman there. We can do these quick now because we know these rooms. Apart from that last room, that last room absolutely murdered us. Yeah, um, hopefully let's get flip some good all your, Flip all your abilities back if you flip them over. I already done that for you guys. Cool. So, this first turn is going to go to you, yep. Dad. I'll take... Uh, two scope plus magic. Oh, uh, Dad. Took it, it might be worth it. You just take yeah, it. Yeah, I'll just tank it all. I don't mind. I can tank it all. Right, so we're all going to just bundle in on this square here. This guy's going to this guy's going to move in. Oh no, you pressed This guy's going to move away. Shot, shot, shot. <laughs> so three damage from the hollow bowman. I take one damage. Three damage from the other guy. I take one damage. My turn. I'm going to move over here and I'm going to smack him for one blue and kill him. Right, your turn, James. Okay. He's going to move in and hit you and he's going to shoot you. So you got four damage physical. Take, take one. one. And three damage magical. One. Take two. Yep, yeah, you're gonna move for free. You can move to there and yeah. stab him with your spear. So I think I'm gonna do a powerful shot. Yep. Yeah. And that's a plus one. Gets so it kills him. Right, uh, Blake, this guy's gonna stay on the node with you and hit you for four physical damage. Okay, I'll put all the dice in the center and take them. <laughs> oh. Do you want to check your flaps? Never mind. I didn't push your line in, but I know some of you lean, If you lean on the table, you're flipping this bit of wood, so don't lean on the table. You lean? <laughs> yeah, but I'm not going to wait on it. I'm leaning on my arm being on it here. Right, so one damage hits his arm, and the other damage goes through, and <laughs> doing both arms. <laughs> yeah, it's different. Um, Basically, we're both rolling. At least I'm checking my flaps. That is 10 times since we sat down. Right, um, six souls, James. Nice. Nice. Right, next room, we're going to cross back across the hallway. We're going to go back to this door here. We're Dad's going to tank it all. We're going to go Bowman. Oh, no, no, it's not worth tanking. Bowman. It doesn't quite work the same. For this one, we want to move someone else. going to move the hollow so, soul drop there. Uh, Dad, you're going first. Yep. So I reckon you go in the middle. Yep. Boom, boom. I'll take aggro. Just so me. they're both going to shoot. I don't mind. They can both shoot me. I don't mind taking the aggro. I get a blue dice on it. Okay then. I don't think it. I think it's probably better. I mean, I would be taking two rounds. So they're going to move to there. He's going to move one forward. So first one's going to shoot me. I will take one damage. You need to Second. reset that. Need to reset. Oh, sorry, I didn't do that yet. So I take one damage. The other guy shoots me. I save all of it. Then my turn. I will move in. 
I will use. No, I'm going to hit him with a blue. I feel confident I can just hit him with a blue. Yep. Yeah. So it kills one of those guys. Right, your turn. Okay, can I? So. He's going to move one away, yeah. so just move him to the left there. That's it. And uh, he's going to move one towards. I'll leave you for you, Blake. Uh, my turn. Actually, I've got a hit shot. Yep. So three magical. So two damage. Um, I'm then going to move, do a stronger shot, and hit him. Yep. Yep, yeah, killed. That's killed him. Thank you. Yeah, Alright, Blake, over to you, because this guy's going to come in and hit you for four damage. So, uh, save that. Ooh. Three oh, bad for it. Yeah, you're fine. Now smack him back. Well, I'll put the dice back in the center. Yep, one damage hits his armor, the other one goes through and kills him. So that's it, another six souls, another room cleared. So these rooms, we can whiz through these rooms. Now let's not have an absolute horror show on the next <laughs> room. Guys, I think all of them. Oh, who's going first? So, Dad, you're going first. Yep, yeah, so. So, Blake takes the Bowman. Bowman. Right. It only makes Knight. sense because then someone else is going to get double tapped. Yeah. Mm. Okay. okay. No one wants to be double tapped. So, he is going to. So, we're all going to go on the node? Or, yeah, all, yeah, all in one. So, he's going to come in and push someone off. So, um, Blake's getting pushed off. Okay. Okay. Uh, he will do five damage to the entire node, which is you and me, James. Hey, did this guy tell me painted? No, I painted everything. Three. So I took three damage. Uh, and I took one, which I've already got on there, so I should leave that there. Right, the, the hollow is going to go... I think we've got to take our time with this. Um, yeah. Oh yeah, I think... You want to go there? Yeah. That I'll allow because that is at least technically closer. Um, then the bowman is going to shoot me for four, but he hits the whole node, so we are both taking four damage. No, from he, no? no, he's shooting Aggro. Blake. He's shooting, he's shooting you, Blake. So you've got to take four damage, Blake, for whatever you can block. Two. Two damage. Not too bad. Okay. Right, my turn. So I feel like I need to kill this guy straight out. So I'm going to do four on him. And then hope the move away, right? Yeah. You don't want to stay on my square because I'm going to get. So I need to see three. Come on, show me three damage. No. Oh. We don't need him around. We need to kill him. I'm going to roll my luck. No. Oh my goodness. Oh. This is going to happen again. We're going to end up using everything trying to clear this room. We are rolling up. terribly. I'll move to there. You think move away. away? Yeah, leave me. I'm going to get tricked. Right, your turn. Now I wish I never used my luck. Because it wasn't lucky. Okay, so... um. Just don't use our, like we've got to find a way of not using our essences because we definitely need those for the boss. Four, so I block, so I take one damage, right? Yeah, one damage. Then, so. And then he's going to. push me back? He's going to push you, yes. Okay, so I'm going to get pushed. Oh, dang it. Can we wreck on this and say we right. move to there? Okay. Because otherwise. So if then I can get pushed back to there. Okay. Because otherwise you, you, one of you guys would have to take another bow shot. Alright, so the bow would now, sorry, now the hollow will move towards you. So okay. he's going to go um, there. Yeah, I did, all I rolled this square, I can do a node here. Yeah, so you're going to take so um, two, damage. two damage. Man, this, this tile is a hard level two tile. Of all the level two tiles, I mean there's lots of so level two tiles. Move again. Because hmm? if it is a zombie gonna move again on my turn? Um, in a minute it will do, yeah. Uh, I, if, I he, if he stayed there, then I'm not using free stamina. Here. I can't physically hurt anyone here. Mm. So why don't you heal someone or do something more? It's only one stamina though. I mean, it could help for you. If I use free, basically I'm kind of tapped out and I don't know what to do. Yeah. Well, one stamina on me is better than nothing. Yeah, 
so I'll heal you for one. If you know you can't physically hurt them, so at least I get one stamina back. Yeah. Right, I'm your turn, of, Blake. I'm kind of stuck here. But now they're going to go first. Yeah, we're so going to have a zombie. I think we could die. So, bang. So, um... No, it's not going to push... Well, it's going to attack first. Yeah, so you guys are both going to get hit. So we're going to take five damage from this guy. I'm going to take three. Basically, you don't pick up dice because my hand is with you. Wait till you take four. Four damage. We are really in trouble, guys. We are not doing well. This tile has killed us. Um... Okay, and then we're gonna get pushed, so separate <laughs> is the uh, thing to do. No, I think go. Um, no, you go, you go further away, Blake, because that zombie's coming for you. Yeah. And you can go there, because then a uh, zombie's there, and he's gonna go to there. She's closer to Blake. Yeah, it's gonna hit me next turn anyway. Doesn't make a difference. Um, and then he's gonna shoot you, Blake. Um, his his armor is his, really his first time he's just kind of yeah. like So now the bowman's going to shoot you for four physical damage and could kill you. Don't. No, because you. No, he can't. Well, at least he can put you down to one. Oh, gee. Yeah, but can, oh, yeah, it's physical. physical. It's physical. Yeah. Alright, you take one more damage. And then he's going to move away. So he's going to move to there. Please don't take any more damage, Jack. Because we're out of health. Um, I would love you to at least kill the knight. Um. um I could move there. I would use. Should I could use your ultimate? To be honest, I could. It's not going to be useful on the boss. You could use your ultimate. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Well, oh, here we are because it's called. Right. So that moves you in for free, unless you hit for free, right. but it hits the whole node. Because it seriously won't two be useful blacks. on the boss. Roll high. Why, Blake? <laughs> ah! We are having a nightmare. I'm going to use my luck. Nightmare. I don't think it's worth it. I don't think it's worth it because even if you roll a two, you don't I mean, hurt the, the knight. If we don't use, if we don't kill at least one, we're all gonna die. So I'm, I'm gonna. You can't kill any of them because you can't roll. You can't physically roll over three to kill that knight. You need to roll. Yeah, you can. Three you can you, you, okay, you, you need a two. That dice needs to show a two, or it's. Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Anyone watching this is just watching a car crash of this first in first at level of the campaign. Why? The dice gods, the, yeah, the dice gods are not with us. They have abandoned us completely. <laughs> right. I don't even know if we can survive. So, I'm gonna die. my turn. So I need both the uh, tokens. Tokens, tokens, tokens. We're all. I think. I think, I think we're, we're dead. Yeah, I think we're gonna. I don't think oh. unless you guys because you haven't estered. And you haven't estered, I think. Should um, I have estered? Doesn't matter. You're not going to get hit, so don't worry. But by the time, remember, his, the monsters go before he gets a gets a go. So when it does become his turn, he's got to weather that damage, and I hope he doesn't Should die. I... Should I do that? I can just do it. Right, the knight's going to move to me. So we can we can change it a bit. So if he pushes can... me away, the hollow won't hit me. Yes, yeah, so if you can survive that, that'd be great. So he's going to do five physical damage, and I get black and a blue. So I take one damage. That's better than nothing. Push, Push me away, and then the hollow will come after me and not hit me. But then the bowman is then going to shoot me for four physical damage. So if I don't save at least two of it, I'm dead. You're all dead. I save all of it. Okay, right. Um, My turn. I get two stamina back. Okay. Um, the best hope I have of killing something is the bowman. So I'm going to move in on the bowman. I would say I'm not really worried about the bowman because You're he's not? five and you cannot escape him at all. Do you think I should try and take him out instead? Yeah. All right, I'll move in and try and take him out. Now, really, for me to do that, I have to... I'm either rolling what is effectively a six. I have to roll a six. Um, or I can use stamina which taps me out so I'd have to enter the ass, Estus. If Do we don't, it. I think we'll die. I don't think we can survive. We're going to die anyway, right? It's worse than the last time you This is worse. Time. This is actually worse. So I'm going to fully fill out my bar, which would effectively kill me, but I will attack and then Estus straight after. And I need to see three. Right, okay. So at least kill him. Oh, but I have no choice but to use my Estus flask and clear my board. 
which means we do not have it for the boss. And we have no more sparks, so we're going into the boss whether we like it or not. <laughs> um, turn goes to you, James. I think it's just we got really the hollow, yeah, the hollow moves towards you. I think we've probably picked the worst out of all those cards. This is going to be the hardest two level, level two tile. It's the dice. It's not the guys. Well, it's the, the dice. The dice is also against us. Okay. Right, so this bone was going to shoot you for four Please physical. Put these back in the Sorry. <laughs> two damage. You've run out. <laughs> That's how bad we're doing. You've actually run out of red squares. <laughs> yeah, that was with me. <laughs> yeah, but it's not about you, so. There you go. I'll take some more. I said that if that's. You still want you dead. I don't know what you're trying to prove. I've right. been on one. James, your turn. I'm on two. You're on two health. Um, Do you have anywhere healing damage? No way of healing damage. I can only heal stamina. Oh, my goodness. So I'm going to switch to my spear. And stab over a zombie. No. No. Um, can I try and take out that bone? Yeah. Uh, but what can you? You can't physically hurt him, can you? Well, I can, but I need to ask this to do it. No, I rolled a super bone. No, you can't do that. You haven't got enough room to. If I ask this. Is it two? Yeah. Oh, yes, it's first. Three. So you're going to rest us? But still, it's like rolling a six. Yeah. Which I have been known to do sometimes, so perhaps. Uh, so yeah, I'll rest. So this needs to show a two because it's two plus one, right? Yeah. Okay. If I, if I, I think if we fail, we in the we, game we'll you get reset. three estuses. Yeah. So I really appreciate getting three. So um. Yeah, so I need two. Oh. I don't get so I'm gonna luck. You know, luck roll it. Yeah. Oh. I'm gonna get even more. I want to die. <laughs> <laughs> we are, we are going to die. It's kind of the motto right. of the game. Um, I think, this, I think this is where we die. I actually think we die right now because uh, it's Blake's turn. Oh yeah, Blake. The hollow is going. Hang on. Yeah, so the hollow is going to move towards you and hit you for five damage. Two. We are almost dead. So two damage goes on. Now you're on one health, and the bowman is going to shoot you. Or if I don't block all of this, you're dead. Yeah, hang on, you need to block. To yeah, you need to block four. You can do it. <laughs> no! We died. Oh, oh man. The game, the game just says prepare to die. And no, we did. That's a game. That's a, yeah, that's that's a, we did die. Um, yeah, we do have one more. That is our. We've gone to zero now on the, on the sparks. Wait, so we, we can go around again. All 12, so grab those two dice. I think we didn't flip it before. I they go know. where he dies. Oh, you don't, oh, do you think that was the last turn, yeah? Yeah, I think it Okay, was. all right, fair enough. Okay. There you go, folks. We didn't even make it to the boss. We died on the this tile, which absolutely murdered us. So we've got to reset everything. So um, we've got to reset our characters and, and start again, but we're not going to do that now. I might play we're going to go have some though, dinner. Like we're going to come back, we're going to draw four new cards, we're going to, maybe, because for fun, we do have the expansion of characters. So I have... I totally want to play Pyromancer. Uh, in here, I have the Kickstarter um, I don't think the expansion, is that which is the character expansion, and it has in it stuff we've never done before. So there is, in here... I'll try and show it to the camera a little bit, but we have the mercenary. We have the pyromancer. Basically, guy dude. We have the sorcerer. I can't quite hear all of them. We have the cleric, the thief, and the deprived, which I think is basically the game on hard mode. Yeah. Um, Pyromancer sounds cool. I didn't even know I you still could think get a hard-mode like, version of I think maybe you're, we need to put you back on the rogue, like the assassin. I'm, I'm okay. I don't think that cleric is all that good. Oh, anyway, are gonna, everybody... Are we going to play after lunch?
we're going to go and have some dinner, and then we might play this evening. But we've got all. I'm off. All, I'm off work all week now, so we can play any days we like. All right. Yeah. Why don't you say goodbye to everybody? It was a terrible failure. Um, <laughs> we feel like we've lost big time. You do um, play after lunch. Look, we can leave this on the table and say you died. Yeah. If you play after dinner, um, I, I might not come down, but I might support you. Oh, yeah. I think, yeah, that yeah. works. Begins. Right. So thanks everyone for watching. Thanks more for, for giving us a bit of chat. That's always nice when people come and talk to us. Um, I can hold this up to say what happened. Look, this is what happened. Do you die? Yeah. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you yes. even make it to the boss. <laughs> yeah, they, they, I like it. They stick it in the in the. It's the first thing when you get the game. The first thing you open when you look open the box is the uh, cover on the top there that says you died. So there you go. And we did. Thanks for joining, everybody. Um, we will be back. This won't defeat us. We definitely want to do this campaign this week. Hopefully, hopefully, can we go back after dinner? Maybe. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we'll see you next time, everybody. See you. Bye. 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 Bye.